Hello and welcome. I'm Nancy Gentle Boudry. Today's exercise in support of my gentle reflection is about expanding our inner world. How we see, how we process, how we feel our life experiences from our inner lens. I think this is so important because society and our times have taught us the reverse. But our outer world is just an experience and is defined by our inner world. Our inner world is where the power is. We live an enriched inner world. We understand and embrace who we are. We are at peace and in alignment with our truths. We vibe that. We send that signal into our external world. I believe when it's the reverse, we cultivate scarcity and fear and all these negative emotions when we allow the external to define our internal. We are unique individuals. And we're pretty complex because we're so, we have so many aspects to ourselves. So I want to center and share with you just a brief exercise on self-exploration from the emotional level. So close your eyes and I'll define and explain as we flow through this exercise. Connect to the flow of your breath. And just feel it flow in, feel it flow out. Make the commitment to drop into your inner world, your stillness, the vastness of your connection to source and your own inner light, your own inner truth, your own authenticity. Don't overanalyze these words, but just drop into the stillness, the quietness with your breath within yourself. I am one with all that is. This is the mindset I want you to have if you need to chant it to kind of settle yourself in. I am one with all that is. I am one with all that is. Feel the words and feel the connection in silence for a moment. Checking in, how do I feel in the present moment? Greeting it, trying to greet it with openness, expandedness. How do I feel in the present moment? Emotionally, how do I feel? Mentally, where am I? And lastly, what am I experiencing physically in the body right now? All three hold this deep wisdom. But I want you to do this as we explore. Notice if you hear harsh criticism of self, judgment of self. I 
I want you to release that, to just look at who you are, how you feel, how you see, with an, a sense of detachment, if you will, like you're observing a movie, observing something outside of yourself. How do I feel in this present moment? Free of judgment, self-criticism. Is there any moment that you're reliving right now that isn't the present? And if there is, then evaluate that emotion, that mental thought pattern, and how it feels in the body. If it is a feeling, a thought, you don't care for, why don't you care for it? Try not to suppress it, ignore it, or try to conquer it. Just greet it with this curiosity and acceptance of your here and now. What do you see truthfully? And allow yourself to hold that experience in your awareness. And then see if you can define it, identify it, like I feel anxious or I feel angry or I feel at peace, content. But greet it with a sense of learning to respond to your own needs. You're allowing yourself to hold whatever space whatever emotion, whatever mentality you're having, it's your unique own emotions, feelings that are your own. There is no right, wrong, good, or bad. Acceptance. And allow yourself to be open to feel it and allow the feelings and the thoughts that you're contemplating to come to the surface. I feel it to deep within my being. And then as you're starting to process it, can you feel it in the body? Is there a physical part of the body? I explored a sense of anger the other day and I felt it in the core of my belly. Insides were all jumbled up. At the same time when I'm at peace, I feel it radiate from my heart. But again, whatever emotion, just ride it. Don't suppress it. Don't let it, um, don't allow yourself to ignore it or try to conquer it or overpower it. You're observing the art of mindfulness is observ observation, purposely aware. And as you open to the emotions and thoughts and you're processing the physical sensations, can you recognize you are not your response or your emotion or whatever you've got going right now. You are not it. You are something greater than it. Allow it. Be open and embrace it because you're allowing it to flow through you. And you're recognizing it has no permanence. I love to equate it to a wave cresting. 
and then receding, cresting and receding. All feelings stay for a while and then they disappear. And you're just allowing these waves to flow through you. So just view him and allow them to pass through you. Recognize their impermanence. When you're ready, open the eyes and see if you can greet with a fresh lens, a fresh sense of self, of your here and now, your acceptance, and see if you you could have moved that emotion out and choose a, a different feeling if it's something you don't want to own. Or just acceptance and peace and contentment in the present moment. And have fun with this. Because you are empowering yourself. You are learning about self. You are your best expert. The spirit in me bows and honors the courageous journey you're taking. Soul to soul, light to light. Namaste. Namaste.